Hello everyone, let's take a look at Easy Chords created by me, the Jack Blod, so that I do not have to play keys. Basically, you just drag the MIDI rack onto your channel and then you drive whatever instrument you want. Of course, you could put this rack before your instrument and have it on the same channel, but the advantage to putting it on a separate channel is we can record the result of MIDI and then edit it later. So record enable this. We're gonna get our MIDI from this channel here. And this is gonna be our final instrument. So the key to making this rack work is mapping the key range to this chain selector, which I have on my Korg pad control, and that selects the different inversions. So we have our standard chord one through and five, uh, sus two, sus four, sixth, and the seventh and then all the same things in um, first and second inversions. So as we play notes, and I hit those keys, we can invert things. Um, so yeah, that's two hands. That's one hand on the keyboard, and the other on the pad control. And you can use a clip or arpeggiator to drive that. You know, so on. Uh, do a little bump. Uh, that's some more. Yeah, maybe not. And clip. So that's about the only one that sounds any good so far, but you get the idea. You can just generate notes and kind of random chord progressions that are going to stay within your key, and it's fun. Uh, this is velocity just for no reason key, this is going to control the, the volume, the velocity of the third and fifth, and these here control the two arpeggiators, which, you know, results may vary. Anyway, hope you enjoy it, and oh, it's important, use 15 keys for this, so that's all of the keys on your pad control, except for one, or, uh, let's see, how many notes are in octave? I don't know. So whatever, that should be on your keyboard count 15 keys and that should map right up and then you're going to have one selection for each. Alright, I hope you dig it.